Man, they just dropped the DLC and this Audino is still roaming the background. Hey, Professor, you look really happy. Did something good happen? Yeah, a great game just got greater. Oh, oh God, he just zipped in there. Oh, there you are. Excellent timing. You see, I was re-examining the results of our survey so far, and I found new teleportation points. Would you look at that? We have new areas to explore. One of them is near the jungle on Belusile... Belu... Yeah. The other is Feluca Island, just beyond the desert. But wait a second, haven't we already researched those islands? Shut up. Anyway, the shrink function should kick in automatically if you run a scan at this one spot in the nature park. All right, just when I didn't think we would be back, here we are. I mean, I've been playing this game casually in my own time because that's what I love most about Pokemon Snap, especially taking pictures of Boofalin's asses. But now we just need to figure out exactly where we can become a Shrinky Dink. All right, I think this is it. Aha, well, that's it. All right, so this is basically just Honey, I Shrunk the Kids Pokemon Edition. Or you know that new game, Grounded, that has an arachnophobia mode? for people that are not a big fan of spiders like I am. Oh, wow, this is really cool. Let's see, can we... Hi, hi, hello, hello, hi, hi. Oh, this is so cool. We're so small. Score Bunny is just endangering... Oh my God, please don't eat me. Please don't, don't eat me. Let's get some feet picks, sell those on the internet. This actually is cool DLC, and I hope they do stuff like this in the future. I think a lot of us didn't know if... Pokemon Snap was gonna get DLC. I thought that was a Yoshi egg, and then I remembered this is Pokemon, and that's a Shroomish. Let's see, what's that over there? Heavy Snores. Okay, well, that's clearly our boy Snorlax. <laughs> what is Purple doing? This is amazing. Game of the year. Wait, we're gonna go up Torterra's butt? No, no! You know, I'd be happy just seeing more big B doofs, or big doofs for short. Oh god, what's that? Oh no. Stay away, Dodrio. Stay back. I have fluff fruits, and I'm not afraid to use them. I, I think there's gonna be a fight here. Uh, Dodrio, you'll get bodied. Are you kidding me? You see the size of this unit? Yeah, what's up there? A bird Pokemon, maybe it's nest owners out looking for food. Here's food. I got plenty of it. I just, I, I don't got the arm to reach it. This is as far as we can go with this test version. Test version? I think we gotta go back, because I didn't see Snorlax. The three-star photo is just gotta get up in its face. Oh, we got a four-star. That's that's a terrible picture, but we take those. See, we got anything new for Wurmple? Oh, yeah, we do. Why, why does Wurmple's nose look like a butt? <laughs> Giant Emolga is terrifying. Well, considering the pictures I had in the past of Emolga that just weren't great, it's finally nice to have one. We gotta go back. I gotta see Snorlax. I, I didn't wake him up. Maybe, uh... Ooh! Hi, Caterpie. Maybe Snorlax is awake at night. Maybe he, he works night shifts and on his day off, he's just up all night. Do we just bounce off of Fungus's head? We are. We're jumping off their heads. It's fungus abuse. Oh, speaking of Fungus abuse, I'm sorry. What's that noise? Oh, God. Oh, Vespaqueen, where'd you come from? Oh, God, do I really want to wake up the, uh... Oh, Jesus, it's the giant pincer. Regular pincers are terrifying. Do we really need a giant one? So I'm hoping they continue to support this game and add DLC through multiple updates. And it kind of seems like they're hinting at doing more stuff with the the shrinking. And also you have Todd saying things like one of the areas is very nostalgic to him. So I'm hoping that we can go back to the moon one day. All right, we got to grow big now. Snorlax wasn't here. We got to go back to daytime and see him. Don't jump on the fungus's head now. Now we'll, we'll crush them. It was okay when we were tiny. It was cute. Speaking of cute. Hey, hey, wake up. I want to take a picture. Come on, let's go, Eevee and Pikachu. All right, back here in the daytime. I ain't leaving. Uh, just a hunch. I have a feeling you'll find something new. It better be Snorlax, or we're gonna have problems. It's kind of funny that people are not realizing that Snap did get a DLC update, because I guess they just didn't market it that well, and it kind of came out of nowhere. Oh, we're, we're on an Emolga. All right, yeah, Wurmple, you shake that thing. You shake that thing. Wait, they lied to me. They said I would see something new. Don't think I'm not gonna find him this time, because I'm gonna. There it is, there it is. Okay, they give you a very slim window to do it, but this is it. There he is. There he is. Oops, that was the wrong one. Oh, we're just, <laughs> we're just gonna climb on Snorlax? Oh, you gotta feed him. Come on, eat more. 
It's actually pretty impressive that Snorlax can eat and sleep at the same time. Something tells me that wasn't it. All right, he's getting up. That's it. That's it. We got pictures of like half of Snorlax's head. I mean, there's got to be a way to wake him up earlier. Oh, <gasps> there he is. This way. This way. Follow the apples. Wait, let's make him go. Oh, hang on. I didn't mean to feed you that. Oh, God. <laughs> no. I thought he was going to kill me. <laughs> Wait, that was 100% worth it. All right, let's check out those other areas now. I actually, I think it's kind of criminal that we can't use more than one of these, but there he is in the background. Just got hit with the Illumina Orb. And this is the last thing that you see before you die. Go ahead, give me your best caption for this picture in the comment section. All right, we're gonna check out the Mighty Wide River, the nutrient-rich river that flows through the entire island. Everyone knows that. This is just like the Jungle Cruise. You know, the ride at Disney and, and not the movie. Why would they make that into a movie? I actually think it's kind of hilarious that Disney has so much money that they can spend millions of dollars to turn a literal ride where you just look at animals into a feature-length film starring The Rock. Oh, Psyduck! Yo, Swampert! Is that Swampert okay? Oh, it's just sleeping. I sleep on my belly, too. It's the optimal way to sleep. I think anyone who falls asleep on their back is a sociopath. I love you, little round girl. Oh, two cannon. I like your cereal. <gasps> More alligator. C come out of the water. Come on, I'm leaving, please. I, I want to see your whole body. I want to see you in your entirety. In your majestic for alligator self. Why does Apom's tail look like something they bought at Glove World? Ew, glove flavored. Oh, good. More pavilion patterns. All right, the jungle at night. Gotta watch out for those predators. So we know there's a lot of them in the Pokemon scene. But there's also more Quagsires! Where is it? Where are, are they preparing us for another for alligator jump scare? I think this could work really well as a horror game. Just put only ghost-type Pokemon. <gasps> Whooper! Hi, Whooper! Hi, Whooper! Don't be sad, Whooper. Okay, don't wake up the for alligator. Whatever you do, look at those sharp teeth. Let it sleep. Listen, I'm never not going to take photos of Quagsire. Just try to stop me. Okay, this is the shot here. This, this might be one of my favorite shots that I've taken in the game so far. Look at the little baby whoopers just following Quagsire. Okay, we have, we have to say goodbye now. But I'll, I'll see you again someday. Got other areas to explore, other Pokemon to photograph. Man, talk about mood swings. All right, the Badlands. We're back in the desert. We got Tape Pig to start. Uh, a seriously underrated starter. I think I just like em <laughs> Look at his face! I think I just like Embor's entire evolution line design. Yeah, that's a good idea. Throw stuff at the Hippodon. Dig with dig, dig with dig. Where's the Doug Trio at? An unstable rock looks like it might fall if it's hit with enough force. We gotta get a Pokemon to come hit it. Okay. Is it is it gonna be the Mandibuzz? There it goes. There Nope. Maybe not. Well, it sure ain't gonna be this apple. Okay, what's that? What, what are you? Come on out of the ground. There you are. Silico- You know what, Silicobra? You're my least favorite snake. You get back in the ground. Look at this coughing, just being a derp over there. You know, if you look at the sprites from Gen 1, coughing is actually upside down, and you have the, the skull and crossbones up top. If you know what I'm talking about, go watch my, uh, go watch my Pokemon Nuzlocke. I, I can't even keep up. There's so many things to scan here. Just a lot of craters in the ground and not enough Pokemon for me to photograph. It's just all pigs and chickens. Badlands, more like the barren wasteland. Taepig's cute, but if I don't pick this picture specifically, then I'm wrong. Wait, what happened here? Diglett turned into an apple. I just gotta figure out what to do with this boulder over here. It's not a boulder. It's a rock. It's a big, beautiful, old rock. What if, hang on, what if I bring a Pokemon here? What was that? What, what was that? Oh, we knocked it over! All right, we did something. Wait, where's the... Oh, did I miss Crustle last time? All right, something's got to come out of here now. We, we plugged that one up. Oh, all right, guess not. Guess we're getting nothing. What's that phobia of too many holes? Because that's kind of kind of the vibe I'm getting over here. Hello! Snorlax here is kind of just like, Hey, you kids get off my lawn! Or what's that ad where people stick their head out the window? They're like, It's my money and I need it now! All right, so going to the Badlands at night is the final area. Overall, wait, hang on. You think I didn't see you? 
Phil's like, I really want to picture a Tyranitar. Well, surprise, I'm getting it before you. Look at these cute friends. This looks like it could be a children's show. Well, technically, I guess Pokemon kind of is already a children's show. You know what I mean. It looks like something that could have aired on Nick Jr. in the 90s. It's like, hey, you want to move this rock again? I do. But there's a little puppy here. Team Crustle really makes me want to go back and play some more Pokemon Unite, which I, funny enough, haven't done a video on yet, but there is a VOD on my other channel. But if you guys want a true Pokemon Unite video edited down, you know, in the old Choctopus fashion, you let me know. All right, time to, uh, you know, take a stroll through the corrosive acid and hope that our shield holds up. I don't suffocate through means of noxious gas. That is a unit. Even the baby. Look at the baby. Okay, bye now. Wait, look at all the Pokemon just kind of like Scooby-Doo in their way through all the holes, and I'm just trying to catch up. And they just go in one door and come out the other. Come on, you're so close. Get up. There he is. You know I couldn't not see my Pokemon Unite main. Yeah, look at him just doing zoomies. Where, where are you going? It's like a superhero. Oh, God, someone help this Magikarp. I mean, we could just, I guess, photograph it. That's cool, right? Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Stop. Oh, I'm going to get myself killed. I mean, overall, this was a pretty solid DLC update, and uh, it also is nice that it was free and we didn't have to pay for it. And people will continue to argue that this game is not worth $60, but you know what? I'm glad I paid $60 for it. And I do think there's going to be another update, so we'll just have to wait and see, and if there is, I'll play through that one too. We'll see you next time.